hide my fish in here. Today we have a six foot cast net, super easy to throw. So what we got, what we're gonna do here, we got about it, we got, I don't know, it's like maybe six, seven foot of rope here. We're just gonna coil it up like this. I'm taking it like that, grabbing it, grabbing it in my hand. And I'm gonna do that until I have the rope all the way down to the, what they call the nut of the cast net. So we're gonna go all the way down. And where's the here, nut? This little part. That's the nut. That's the nut. We're gonna pull it up all the way so you can't pull it anymore until it's right about there. You're gonna grab it, maybe like six to 12 inches down. Some people prefer it differently. And then I'm gonna grab the middle of the cast net right here. Grab that. So now I have the rope six inches above the nut and the middle of the cast net all in my hand right there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab the rope. Some people like to put their weight in their mouth. I think it's easier just to put the rope in your mouth because it doesn't, you know, it doesn't mess up your teeth as much. Put the rope in your mouth. Now I'm gonna grab the other part of the net here and I'm going to throw it over my shoulder. I'm gonna throw about one big throw is enough. One big throw of the cast over your shoulder and then you want to grab it. It's about like four or five inches right there. Okay, that. I'm gonna hold that in my in my right hand. Then I'm gonna go down. I'm going to grab the farthest weight down that I can. Normally, I like to grab about four weights down. About to five weights down. I'm gonna do five. So I have about five weights down right here. And then all you're gonna to wanna to do is gonna to want to rear back. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna let go of the all the stuff in this hand first and then right before the net's out of your hand you're going to want to release the weight so you're going to want to hold the weight in your fingers the longest because it'll open up the net and you don't want to hold it too tight that it holds the net back from opening up all the way so i'm going to say give it a throw boom and your pancakes so there you go that's how you guys throw a cast net that is a six foot cast net just about the best way to catch mullet during the mullet run really any bait fish in shallow water six foot net catch everything from mullet to pilchards to whatever you may want so we're gonna go ahead and demonstrate that a few more times for you guys we're gonna go ahead and demonstrate that a few more times because what we want you guys to do is to be able to from watching this video be proficient at throwing a small cast net guys because this is the first one we want you to learn the small cast net is the easiest one to throw and it's the most effective for most baits guys i got about another little pot of trout mullet right here Little tiny, 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 tiny mullet. Got him. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the way to go. Yeah. Nice. Oh my god. One throw. <laughs> mullet run you guys mullet run look at this look at this freaking mullet run mullet run baby let's go well a few of them are getting out <laughs> <laughs> just close that thing <laughs> video all right you guys so remember we always have to clean up the ocean Look at this plastic right there. That will kill a turtle. A turtle will think that's a jellyfish. Got to get that plastic out of the ocean. Brandon, right here. That's it, buddy. Get that plastic out of the ocean. Good work.